Are you ready for this? I hope you are. It is Tuesday, April 23rd, 2019. Now, what am I talking about? Would you believe, would you believe that right now in the market, there is a miracle occurring? Yeah, I, I'm not kidding. There is a miraculous event occurring, not just in the stock market, but also in the bond market. We have a simultaneous rally in the debt market. Oh, yeah. And in the stock market. <laughs> this is so unnatural. And I am laughing about it. People, I've covered this a million times. This kind of environment is so twisted that you have to sit back and laugh when you watch something like this occurring. Do you want to see what this looks like? Okay, I'm going to show it to you. Right now, stocks are higher across the board. Nothing major, but a rally nonetheless on Wall Street. And if you are if you are interested in just having your eyeballs explode, again, in the description of this video is a link to my website. Go look at the bond market chart. Prepare your eyeballs by placing a, a welder's mask on or something. Again, look, I don't know how to say this to you. Um, anyone that understands these markets knows this is unnatural. It's unnatural. You don't see it. So this is more of the in-our-face rigging fakery um, that we've been witnessing now since it feels like time immemorial, since the 2008 takeover of the markets by world central banks, none more so than the Federal Reserve. We do not have a free market at all. And again, what's going to happen? When all of this corrects the fair value, when these miracles of the market, simultaneous rallies in the debt market and equities, finally normalizes, you know what's going to happen? They're going to blame the market. It's not the market. The market is not being allowed to do its one and only job. The markets have one job, people. You know this. To determine fair value. Period. When world central banks, look, are doing what they're doing now, artificially suppressing rates, it creates a, a an environment of distortions. It's unbelievable. Seriously, by suppressing rates, it pushes cash into risk on assets. Hence, what we're seeing now. By cash moving into the debt market, rates get suppressed, cash moves into stocks. Duh! They think we're blind and stupid, but we're not blind and stupid. It's right in our face. No one wants to talk about it. You got the confederacy of dunces. Are you watching this? They're like this. <laughs> They're in their orgasmic state again because stocks are higher. But no, no, no. Don't look at what's going on in the debt market. You're not supposed to know that. I swear to you, you cannot make this stuff up. If you freaking tried, you couldn't write it in a science fiction novel of any kind. Well, that's where we are. I just, look, enjoy the show uh, and capitalize on it, period. Speaking of that, I closed my position in Apple, my entire position this morning. Did very well on that trade. Um, and I hope you lions and lionesses and my beautiful cubs are getting in on these trades. Um, all right, with that said, uh, wow, miracles. Miracles do happen on Wall Street. I will see you at the end of the day.